Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you the process video of um, the painting I just finished. Um, so for this one, I used acrylic and gouache on a wood panel. I think it's birch wood. Um, I've been working on it for about a month, but in total probably like six hours I think. So I started off with a pencil drawing. Uh, I used a red pencil onto the birch wood. Um, I didn't really plan out this drawing, I kind of just winged it. Um, I think that when I do that it's a lot more flowy and uh, it's a lot more fun than um, planning out a drawing and transferring it because it always loses a lot of the, the flow once you transfer it. I really like working on wood. It's probably my favorite uh, type of canvas to work on just because of the... I like it because of the wood grain and I always try to leave some of the wood grain behind the painting just so you can really tell that it's like... that it's integrated with the background. Um, Um, so the first part I did was uh, use kind of like a wash on the background just to um, just to keep some of the wood grain in instead of covering it completely uh, and then I, I wanted to keep her skin with the wood grain as well so I just used a light light coloring and shading on that and then I used colored pencil over it. The next step was to paint the flowers in her hair um, and then after that I worked on the details and then I used color pencil over the paint just to get a bit more shading in and um, a little bit more texture as well. And then after that I start inking. I really like using a brush pen instead of actual paint just because I have a little bit more control and it's a lot faster than having to it's a lot faster than having to dip the brush in the paint every time. Uh, once I was done with the drawing, I cleaned it up a little bit and then I sprayed it with workable fixative. So some of the hard parts and uh, any problems I came to while doing this painting was definitely working with the wood. 
wood is a really hard surface to paint on just because it's very unforgivable and um, once you put paint down it's absorbed and you can't really get rid of it you just have to paint over it So after I finished inking most of the lines, I decided to add in her tattoos. Uh, I used watered down acrylic and some mixed with ink, and I just painted over her skin. So that's about it. Uh, I wanted to thank you guys for watching and please subscribe and like this video if you'd like to see more. Thank you so much.